Tom, how many times have you been to the, what's this place called again? It's the Pioneer Grill. How many times have you been to the Pioneer Grill? Well, it depends. On each trip, I try to go eight, nine, ten times. Some years, but it's iconic. It's it's truly part of the Western history. This is a tour. Like you had parents that had no life, so the answer is you went on a vacation to Jellystone Park, and on the way up three hours south yeah. of Jellystone, you stop here. Do you think that the policymakers here, whether at the Fed or others, know? the difference in menu prices from this year versus last year, and this informs them to the degree to which like inflation is still a problem? It does, but does it seriously form into their dual mandate? I mean, the chicken wings are $16. What is this, Brooklyn? So the Fed has their preferred measure of inflation, PCE, but if they were gonna look at this menu, they would see that their job is not done. PGI, Pioneer Grill Inflation. There we go. Because if you compare the menu to last year, the pulled pork sandwich is now $18, Last year it was $17. The brisket French dip is $20. It is up, up a whopping $2. It's like 11% inflation. What? That's the Weisenthal math you're doing. Yeah, a, you a nailed little, that. I didn't even need a calculator to divide <laughs> 2 into 18. So based on Pioneer Grill prices, Fed's got a hike. Fed's got a hike. Sanka!